Alright. Say hi to mom. Hi mom. Everybody suck in the gut. Now what do we do? I want to fit in more. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. How do you get that one to Damn flat belly. This is the Howard Eaton Trail, just uh, just near Grants Pass. It's about a mile from our first night's camp. We're about uh, five and a half miles in now. Come on, guys. Bravely, fastly. We need some sound effects. John made it. <laughs> Barely. Do you hurt, John? The what? Do you hurt? Yeah, I hurt. <laughs> uh. You have to get the full effect, Jay. You have to be swinging. Joe hurts. You have to be swinging. <laughs> this, this is a swing in the hammock perspective. All right. <laughs> oh, see, my feet stay, uh, stay even. <laughs> And there's Blaine back on that side. Blaine doesn't hurt. <laughs> no, Blaine doesn't hurt at all. This is about two miles from Shoshone Lake. We're going to go take that as a day hike tomorrow. And after tomorrow, we walk over that rise and down to Ferris Fork. So this is Blaine's creation. We're still at 9G1, first day in. About six and a half miles in. So this is day number two. We're on the uh, little day trip down to the lake. We're only about uh, half a mile from camp here. All right, this is about two miles from our camp. This is the first view of uh, Shoshone Lake. We're at the uh, geyser basin off to the right. John made it. Here comes Joe. Geyser basin's off that way. That's where we're heading now. Uh, this is uh, the geyser basin, just a few feet away. Let's go there. Should be a geyser right up ahead, John. Pardon? Should be a geyser right up ahead here. Okay. Yep. Let's stop long enough to change the film and this thing. Sure. Go to a shady spot then. Right, right here. That was it, huh? Good time. Are we looking for hot pots or are we just walking? 
Uh, right now we're just doing both. I figure we're not going to go swim until after we explore the place. Do you know where it is? Uh, you, maybe you see any? No. Well, there's stuff. I think right in there. That, that would be pretty good right there, wouldn't it? Here they are in the hot pot, the like three walruses trying to keep the water wow. at the wow. right temperature. Like someone stuck, stuck a dagger in there. This is for Marianne to show her that we're not dumping John in the water. <laughs> Sally doesn't care if Joe goes in the water. <laughs> true, true. And Liz is pissed that Blaine didn't go. Right. Okay, we're on day two, about two and a half miles from camp. Just across the ooh, second continental divide. Heading over to our third, which is only about a mile away. You know the fly. Did you get my Georgie Tech? I was going to take a picture of the trees over there. Oh, I thought, you're right. <laughs> okay, the group picture. Okay, it's about three miles into the second day. It's all downhill from here, which we're all glad about. We only had to climb about uh, 700 feet today. We're going to be going down about 1,300 feet to our campsite. Yeah, it's about five miles from here. There's Blaine's best side. This little stream here um, originates up in the hills above us here. No crossing, so it's good to drink. You guys ready to go? Ready to go. You get food down yet? No. Okay. Can we get on the way out? This is Delta One. This is uh, Tuesday morning. We stuck right out here on this point between these two rivers last night, right up here in the snow. That's where Blaine and I slept last night. Okay. We're heading up to the hot tub. If the battery's going to hold out, we'll go all the way with you. Felt hot. Is that where it is up to the steam is? Yep. Yeah. <laughs> morning, gentlemen. Good morning. You too, Jay. <laughs> I must have been stepping on a bit. Sit down, will you? You can't see anything. <laughs> Set down a bubble. Don't, don't give him a... <laughs> All right. He doesn't like it. Yeah? All right. Now, there's a little ritual you got to go through. Here we go. John, you got to do this. If you don't do this, the pot won't be here next year for you. This time you come. Since I'm the newcomer? Come on, I'm go back. No, 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 no. Oh, I got go. One, go, quick, quick, quick. Good back, yeah. <laughs> uh, 
Joe, you're on tape now. Don't get your butt too high in the air. That last one was like a whale going over. This is 250 pound bump. Here's Jay in the hammock. And of course, all hammocks come with a complimentary view. Maybe a hundred yards or so back. You want to go, John? Okay, this is um, Thursday morning, I think. Just got out of the pot. Right over that rise, there's about 12 people fixing to get in. We're going to get out of here for a little while. Let them have the pot. All right, this is Thursday morning. We're taking a little day hike up to the falls. This is Glenna Falls, first one from the hot pot. We just left John back there, by the way, fellas. Which is a smart move. Yeah, it is. <laughs> This is Tendoy Falls, about a mile away from the, uh, or three quarters of a mile away from the hot pot. Here's Jay's idea of a good time. This video is in case he falls and dies, just to prove we didn't do it to him. He did it to himself. Now it's my turn. Here comes Joe for the camera. Be right back. Eat. Two, go! Had a big adventure by Blaine. Last time I was here, I had 22 Boy Scouts in with me. <laughs> this is better. What? <laughs> oh, I missed you. <laughs> Who's next? Gotta go over the bus. Okay. Oh, yeah. We gotta get some names. Huh? What's your name? Uh, Alian. Alian. Yeah, well, did that hurt? Colleen. Colleen. Emily. Emily. What's your name? I back up a little bit. Get close. No, no, no. Hold just on, go. Get just go out and over. Just don't leave your legs behind. Get closer first. Right there. All right. Okay. I feel like right there. You did it. All right, that counts. 8.5. Alian. I'm done. You're cooked. <laughs> Ooh, that was good. It stopped bubbling when you did that. <laughs> oh, that's okay. They're allowed one attempt. <laughs> that's two attempts, Neil. And this is early Friday morning, our sixth day out. About seven o'clock in the morning. Got pretty chilly last night.
This is uh, on the way to the hot pot. Now this way, and this is uh, Saturday. Breaking camp from 91. There's some other people already in it. This is Beckler Meadows. Right up ahead is uh, campsite B9. It's about three quarters of a mile, a mile away from ours. This is still in Beckler Meadows. So uh, an elk that didn't make it last year. through our Saturday trip. This guy's out in the meadow just uh, outside our campsite. Here's the falls again. This is a bear print. Uh, we've been tracking this bear, I guess, for the last three miles. There's the moose again. Actually, kind of glad to see the bear print still heading out. It means it should be below our camp and out. These tracks are probably day old. John, why don't you go fill up yours so you know you got enough water to be boiled to fill yours up? Go fill your jug up with water. It's hard to want to move. Then just sit there for a little bit. Hey! Put a little cracking on that one. All right, this is uh, in the middle of Beckler Meadows, last day, it's about 9.30 in the morning. Where do you see Wheeler? There's Grand Teton in the background. Oh, there he is. And that's, uh, that's the top of uh, Rolling Thunder and Moose Basin where we camped last year. And the rest of Tetons. These are the meadows. My life exhibit ahead. <laughs> This is great. Bone didn't mind the flash either. I'm sorry I didn't bring the camera now.